my name is Joe Zimmerman with SJE Rhombus. Today I'm here to introduce our new 32XR control panel. This is a three phase duplex transducer control panel. It also has flow backups. The 32XR panel is a NEMA 4X EO listed control panel with several external features. We have locking latches, we have a red alarm beacon, on the side you have an external horn as well as a silence test button. The internal components of the 32XR panel are the LC3X industrial grade controller. We have two HOA switches. We have two motor starters and also a metal inner door. Behind the inner door we have several components. We have a multi-tap transformer. This is good for three voltages, 208, 240, 480. This is a lightning arrestor to, for protection. You have heavy duty incoming power lugs and you also have incoming field wiring on this terminal block. The LCX3 controller has many features. It has an alarm LED indicator, a pump 1, a pump 2 LED indicator, and in this case pump 3 is not used. There's also an escape and back button, and this is the rotary selector wheel for scrolling through menus and adjusting values. Going into the main menu of the LCX3 controller, you have alternation, level set points, counts and elapsed time meters, level simulation, and advanced settings. Let's start with alternation. In this selection, you can alternate pumps one and two, or you can do pump one lead or pump two lead. In level set points is where you adjust the lead pump on and off heights, leg pump on and off, as well as your high and low level alarms. Counts and ETMs, elapsed time meters, is where you can view the number of hours on each pump, as well as the run cycles. Also, high and low water alarm counts, as well as float backup closures. Level simulation is for testing and diagnosing problems with the panel. In advanced settings, you can calibrate the transducer, pump delay times, set point dwell times, as well as backup float run times.